different ways. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, like just Ruben Lewis is like a boss jazz musician, so yeah. he's pretty inspiring to be around. Cool. And cool. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Alright. Hi and welcome to Sin Media. I'm Bridget and today I'm joined by Tom and Alicia from 3070. Thank you for joining Hi. us this morning. How are you guys going? Yeah, very good. <laughs> Real good. Having our chais and coffee? Yes. Yeah. yeah, beautiful. So we're here today to talk about how you guys are heading to Warm Adelaide in a couple of weeks. Cause so are we. Oh, and we're super excited, so we're trying to hit up all the people from Melbourne that are going over as well. Yeah. So how do you guys feel about Warm Adelaide? Have you guys been before? Uh, no, no, I've always wanted to go. Yeah? Yeah, yeah pretty excited. Pretty excited. So who are you looking forward to seeing on the lineup? I guess? I think we're all pretty excited about the new Sangari. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it would just be yeah, just the lineup is spectacular, and then seeing yeah. you guys as well, and that like representing the Melbourne, that side, this side of the scene, I guess, yeah. at that like world music style festival is actually incredible. Yeah. So congratulations on scoring a spot. It's okay, I can praise you more during. <laughs> so um, you guys, how could you guys explain how the collective? kind of came about. So people who know about you know about how there's five central members and then you guys all come together and make different styles of songs and music and you have heaps of side projects. Mm. So how did that all come together? I guess it's a pretty organic process. Yep. Having people that are very creative or working together and obviously like in lots of different styles so had to make different projects for different gigs, sometimes just one gig, or, yeah, I suppose it's, I suppose it's, yeah, continuously expanding. Yeah, that's really beautiful. Yeah, expanding and exploring, like experimenting with um, mm -hmm. different, um, different sort of genres that we uh, maybe want to, want to dig deep into, mm -hmm. um, and yeah, like Ali said, like sometimes it's just one gig with a different project, and sometimes it's it's more of a it turns into more of a thing. Yeah, cool. So with the expansion of the collective, it's also come with um, expansion of fans overseas. Have you guys travelled overseas and like toured through Europe and stuff? Where no. So have you had people come down from <coughs> Europe and like tell you that they heard your music over there? Yeah, because I've had a few people that have been <laughs> come, oh, cool. like come through and been like, yeah, I've seen 37 they're really sick and they're like from France. Oh, wow. Yeah. Cool. So. I guess through like um, Bradley's era, rhythm section, like, mm. we did a boiler room like late last year. Yeah. Those Haven't been Not over? To Europe, yeah. That's <laughs> alright, you'll probably meet more fans when you head over to Warm Adelaide. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> um, so the me you two are a part of the main five members. So where do you guys do you guys um, draw your inspiration from the people that you bring into the collective, or do you guys have musicians that you look up to? Uh, big question. Sorry. Pretty, <laughs> pretty inspiring. Yeah. In lots of different ways. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, like just. Ruben Lewis is like a boss jazz musician, so yeah. he's pretty inspiring to be around. Cool. And everyone, I shouldn't just <laughs> say one of them, they're all really inspiring. Nathaniel's like the hardest working musician in Melbourne, he's in every band. Yep. Um, do you have any, so you guys have toured with a lot of other Melbourne bands, so there's like GL, Sex on Toast, I'm trying to, my brain's not working, but like <laughs> heaps of them. Do you guys have anybody that you haven't toured with that you would like to, like, perform with? Oh, we haven't toured with any of those bands. Performed with. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I used the wrong word, so. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> yeah. Um, do you have anybody that, that you would like to perform with that you haven't yet? Lots of people. Yeah. Yeah, just performing with anybody, like, yeah, it's always, <laughs> it's always a good time. It's always a good time, yeah. Like, and especially, like, artists you haven't, I don't know, 
haven't haven't listened to before as well. Like just mm -hmm. discovering discovering new music. It's always so much, so many great artists around. Yeah, they all just appear in Australia. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's it's really awesome. It's really but cool. I don't know. Are you yearning to to do a gig with somebody? I'm just yearning to do the gig. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. That's nice. That's cool. Um, do you guys have anything coming up, like, that you two are releasing? Because we just had um, Horatio Luna drop Local Honey, and then who's part of the side projects, which is cool. Big fan. Check it out. Um, <laughs> um, do you guys have anything coming up in the works that we can expect? Yes. Yes? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Cool. Heaps of stuff. Oh, awesome. Oh, just yeah, just always working on new, new things. Mm -hmm. But um, yeah, there'll be some um, some new music coming out from yeah, just the um, the whole the whole group like um, over the next six months, Ooh. like a few probably a few a few more records. Awesome! Yeah, that sounds so good. So, what can people expect from um, the Warm Adelaide show? I guess that's the next question. What music are you guys gonna indulge everybody with? With the warm added? Yeah. Warm added so, uh, we talked about this actually because I think a lot of uh, the warm ad bands will be like quite big bands and like a lot of world music, big sounds. So we want to, uh, and it's a lot of people playing. So I was thinking about our intention just maybe being a bit more mellow and uh, deep groove music. Ooh, yeah. That sounds really nice. Yeah. And a really different, yeah, like you said, a really different vibe to the rest of the performers that are playing on that Saturday night when you guys are. Yeah. yeah it would be a really nice respite when people just like, yeah. Yeah, I think that's good. what I'd want. Yeah. Yeah. Ease you in. Yeah. It yeah. sounds really good. Well, I look forward to seeing what you guys come out with in the next six months and look forward to seeing you guys at Warm Adelaide. Hopefully I'll be like, hi guys. <laughs> 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 um, where can people check you guys out? Well, you've got so many people to check out. So. <laughs> <laughs> um, I guess all the regular spots. Mm -hmm. Bandcamp, Facebook. Facebook, MySpace. High Street. Yep, High Street. <laughs> Lentils. Lentils. <laughs> Awesome. So we'll catch Alicia at Lentils and Tom at Warm Adelaide. <laughs> you really so will. <laughs> Actually, both of us. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> See you guys at Lentils. <laughs> awesome. Thank you guys so much for letting us into your home and having hey. a little interview. Thank you so much. Thank no you. Worries. Thanks, Bridget. No worries. <laughs>